Albert. This is actually really interesting because I feel like he's doing a legitimate uh, call for help and his friends are just fucking laughing in his face. Yeah, it's true. Um, I'll just say it. I'm falling apart <laughs> from the inside out. I know on the outside it looks like uh, all is well and dandy. No, it doesn't. No, it's not. It oh, it doesn't? No, you just have to say my insides are starting to mirror my outside. My insides are starting to mirror my outside. Mike is such a douche. Yeah, I fucking he doesn't seem like guy. a good friend. At all. And Mike's sober too, isn't he? Like, yeah. You know. Well, his whole thing is like, his whole shtick is that he's like an addiction specialist. Right, he's in recovery and everything. and yeah. Catching up. The, yeah. the gradual collapse you've been witnessing um, for from the outside has now ruptured my insides. There's no spleen. My maid. I can't believe I'm saying this. In Puerto Rico, my maid, my my Puerto Rican assistant, uh, my Puerto Rican driver, my accountants back in America, and my assistant Danny, my beloved Danny, for three and a half years of work together are all leaving at the same fucking time <laughs> they did a huddle i swear to god They're like come in team come on in come on in hey probably did. fuck this guy am i right yeah that i mean that just tells me that he is just such a horrible dude to work with mm. that they're all like because especially in puerto rico it's got to be a good job to work for like someone like logan paul i mean well paying you would assume right i mean i don't perhaps. know but but yeah. perhaps but like um that just tells me that he really is fucked. Yeah, it's true. You uh, can't help but feel kind of bad for him in this clip. Exactly. Yeah, I will say, though, he when he's surrounded by such horrible friends. Mm -hmm. right, right, they're just, like, laughing.